Hey, it's Jeff, and I just wanted to circle back after that amazing fundraiser we did at LaunchCon for Shanta Foundation. And so the folks at Shanta just had me and Mary and my kids out to, to a fantastic barbecue, and they had a slideshow there to show all the incredible work they've done with, uh, with all the money that we raised at LaunchCon, and it really is amazing. And I was incredibly proud and incredibly impressed and you should be proud as well because you were part of that story. So they have a really quick slideshow. I think it's just take a few minutes. And when I say take a few minutes, I, what I'm saying is you're gonna wanna watch this just to see the amazing work that you were part of. This is really, really cool. I'm so glad we had them out there. I'm so glad that you supported them in such a big way. It was amazing. So definitely check out this slideshow. And they do have um, a few spots on their donor trip. From what I understand, the last time I talked to them, a few spots in their donor trip this coming January. Mary and I are still trying to figure out if it's gonna work for our schedule, um, but you might wanna check that out because everything I've seen about those donor trips, they look absolutely amazing. So that being said, check out the slideshow. It's gonna be really cool. Hello, and greetings from Myanmar, or as they say in the villages there, Mingalaba. I'm Laurie Meininger, the Executive Director for the Shanta Foundation, and I wanted to bring you up to date on what's happening in the villages that you launched last November. It's planting season right now in Myanmar. Our villagers are out in the fields getting ready for the rainy season, which has just begun. With your help, we've been launching four new villages this year. We've been very busy since the first of the year. With your partnership, we've been launching villagers on the path out of poverty, lifting people up from their bamboo and leaf homes, helping them with water systems so that they're not bathing in streams and helping them overcome food insecurity. When you only have a few dried ears of corn, it's hard to get through the year. Since November, we've launched four new villages, complete with village development teams, We've been helping them map their communities and assessing their community resources. We've established community loan funds in each of those four villages and already have folks who've been borrowing money, budding entrepreneurs, farmers looking to increase their crop yield, and parents looking for a better education for their children. You know, the village process is one that in invites everyone in the village to have a voice. In each of our villages, unanimously, people have opted in for their new village launch. Since we started with LaunchCon, we've built new schools, bringing kids out of bamboo-walled schools with dirt floors into proper classrooms, complete with furniture, resources for teachers, and a place that any kid would want to go and be proud to be a student. These new schools create a learning situation that keeps kids in school and hopefully on the path to higher education. We've also in these schools built water systems complete with latrines. <laughs> I don't know about you, but the prospect of using a latrine that is a hole in the ground versus one with some proper water plumbing sure seems like a step up. Also since last November, we've held dental clinics. And in fact, this past December, with your help, we served over 1,300 children from 16 villages, getting dental checkups, treatments when they needed them. And with our Burmese dental partners, we gave away literally thousands of toothbrushes and toothpaste for keeping those smiles so bright and shiny. With you as our partners in the four villages that we've launched this past year, we're reaching more families than ever. We're bringing increased income, improved health, leadership skills, and prosperity to over 12,000 villagers in Myanmar this year alone. Your partnership makes a big difference in each of the villages that we serve. 
We hope that you'll keep your partnership with Shanta and the villagers in Myanmar, those families and children, alive and well, by donating today at www.shantafoundation.org. And we want to thank you for your partnership in launching villages on the path out of poverty in Myanmar.